with this one, I love the little bike and decided to just do a simple uh, pop-up using the tab. And so I turned the tab at an angle like this that fits up here in the basket area. And I've run that through already. So we'll fold it and see how three-dimensional this is going to look. And so here I've got another basket. And then I cut out another piece of just the flowers. I'll trim this just a little bit more here. And then I've put a little pop-up square on the back of that so that the flowers will be even more three-dimensional. And I'll mention that sometimes when you're planning things out, you might choose to use um, some of these glue dots that are removable and that would let you reposition something if you needed to. So let me see if we can apply a glue dot right there. I don't want it hanging off the edge. And then my basket will get lined up. Okay, and this one just has a simple fold all the way across. Sometimes I'll score just the outer edges to find that middle point. Ah, that came out very simple but very effective. And the basket was easy to cut comparing to all the detail of the bicycle. So that way you can color just the elements that you need to really create a nice three-dimensional little pop-up card. And there, if you can see from the side, that's just using the little tab at an angle um, to work that way.